You know, I'm starting to think I'm never going to get rid of you guys. Boss, is that such a bad thing? Yeah. Yeah, it is. Throw the tape of Buzz Aldrin punching that dude in the face. <laughs> <laughs> French cat play, baby. The smell of the candle and the pumpkin is very important in my childhood. Pope, Ripley, and honestly, I can't wait to get to number three. You want to keep the kids away from the devil. <laughs> oh, yeah. And the devil comes out. <laughs> Speaking of awful music and banging, do you remember, I mean, I'm, I'm mad at kids today because you just get to have like a, remember making a bang playlist back in the day, we had to like burn it off the radio and shit, oh, yeah. so it was all, the best of what was available. Yeah, you were considered a pirate. Oh, yeah. <laughs> but also like, you had so few songs to actually choose from. If you try to put a sex tape together, you had to be like, I guess Teenage Dirtbag works. Yeah, I guess Teenage oh, yeah. Dirtbag followed by 112. <laughs> Peaches and Cream. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, no sense of a rhythm nah, whatsoever. Nah, 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 what would nah. be the worst song to bang to? What would be the worst sex song ever? I, you know what? I've given this some consideration. Of course. And I think you're going to like this. I'm throwing on some Monster Mash. Good answer. The, the Monster Mash and, and play it at a volume low enough that you can kind of make it up, but you don't really know. And then as you're banging, like, what the fucking monster mash? Yeah, it was repeat. a graveyard smash. I was working in the lab. Yeah, I'd wait, say there's situations where that would be fitting. Yeah, I've oh, done yeah. that for sure. Oh, yes, of <laughs> yeah. course you have. That's well, my go-to. Oh, of course yeah. you have. Talking about worst songs. Here. That's Mike, in, like hey, baby, you want to go outside of a graveyard smash? <laughs> That's in the Juggalo handbook. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you only fuck it's to monster mash. Tree. Not only, but like a lot. <laughs> Not a lot. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> You're allowed get to put the, other songs in there. Get the Fago and the <laughs> fucking Bluetooth I you were calling speaker. me something different. Yeah, they really did. You did come in hot on that one. Light the incense tonight. We're going to smash to the match. <laughs> <laughs> I was walking it on a hob. Oh, God. Every time I hear this song now, I get hired. <laughs> Luckily, it's only one day a year. Buddy. See, if we went back 15 years with big old dinks on us, I'll Would you rather be... Here's your options. Would you rather be 10 years older than you are right now to the day? All right. But 10 million in your bank account. Uh, or would you rather be 15 years younger than you are today with just a big old hog on you? All of us could uh, have fun banging people to Monster Mash and shit oh, like that. Yeah. I mean, absolutely. <laughs> I mean, you could now, I guess, but it'd just be sad. But back then, it'd be funny. <laughs> if you're young and attractive with a big ding, it's fun. But if you're 40 with your wife <laughs> banging to Monster Mash, it's just sad. Look, if you want to keep adding little details to this fantasy of yours, go call me and bang people to your big dick. Like, it'd be fun to do it with the Monster Mash in the background. I'm going to let you have that, Crease. But Thank I'm not going to sit here and agree with you. Like, yeah, Crease, no, that makes it better. No, no. That, that's why we'd go back. That's all I ask for. But yeah. I'm with you there. Literally anything. I'm not ready with like, If we could do that, but with the big dicks. <laughs> yeah. We've already established best. we're still getting the money either way, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're all going to be right. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, then we can play whatever we want, Chris. Yeah, we're, okay, just, yeah. we're just stamping the passport yeah. at this bring point. The, bring the Monster Mash <laughs> bring with monster you. Mash we're stamping something. the passport right now. <laughs> but also, you don't have to bring the Monster Mash with you when we get back. It was already out. <laughs> it was right. It's been around since the 50s or whatever. Bring your own mash. Yeah. B-Y-O-M? B-Y-O-M. It's a B-Y-O-M party. B-Y-O-M-M? Bring your own goddamn mash. Bring your own Monster Mash, you fucking dickweed. You got an answer? I don't know if we're going to beat Monster Mash. I would say probably I just wouldn't. I wouldn't like the scat, man. Scat, man. Yeah, it'd be a weird. It would be a weird tempo to fuck, too. Yeah, you really really don't want to out to BPM your own (laughs) bass. Yeah. I do I do like that the whole song's about him overcoming his stutter, so I feel like it would kinda like embolden me to yeah. like get Is that like, what that song's about? hundred <laughs> percent. Is that actually what that song's 100%. about? hundred percent. Wow. Skibby dooby doop o be doop bow. He started scatting because he was stuttering too much, so he started scatting so he could get like better control over his rhythm. He thought that would actually keep his friends years. around, but he just became more annoying. All his friends were like, yo, go back to stuttering because all this scat That's is right. making me want to skedaddle. I liked you better when you were a stuttering boy and not a scat man. Yeah, yeah. absolutely. This man that you've turned into, straight scat. You used to be scat. a scat boy, but I dare say scat boy. Now, Come you're here. a scat man. You're a scat man. But then if you listen and it gets to the, if you get listened to long enough to, for it to get to the verse, it's like just inspirational talking. 
things were tough, but now if you work really hard, you can get past okay. it. And I say. do it not know. Yeah. That's not no, really. True. That's not true. <laughs> Those are the words, but <laughs> okay. that's the that's the. I don't remember that part at all. Me I thought either. it was all scatting. Yeah, because nobody ever listens past twenty seconds. You never listen to a minute and a half of scat, man. No, you don't. You don't play that through. No, the it comes in hot and it's really cool for about eighteen seconds, and then you go Is fucking it? turn this shit off. <laughs> well, <laughs> compared to the rest of it, this is the best thing I've ever heard. Go back to your AI sex doll. <laughs> you know what? I'll just play it for my AI sex doll so she can just play it out of her mouth later. I heard you like Scatman a lot. Can I please read the first? You can fuck it. Suck my toes. You can fuck it while I play it. I think you need to be a little close to that mic, douche. But yes, please read us some of the lyrics. Okay, so after the 30 seconds of scatting, it goes, everybody stutters one way or the other, so check out my message to you. As a matter of fact, I don't let nothing hold you back. If a scat man can oh, do damn. it, so can you. Exactly. I saw the behind the music of what the fuck this thing was. It was all about, he's like, uh, yeah, he was bullied a lot. He sort of became the scat man, right? So he was then bullied more. I did not more. know that. Step up. We had very different so I, I feel like it might motivate me to... <laughs> be better at banging better, yeah. The scat man? Yeah, he can do it. If he can get overcome a stutter, I can overcome whatever. I'll just start thinking about how I am at talking. <laughs> <laughs> my, 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 what, what motivation am I getting here? You know, maybe I Your could dirty use talk something. is just crystal clear. No, it's, it's just not. Like, maybe nope. I could use something there. That's fair. That's fair. But I don't think scat man's going to bring it out of me. I think it's just going to throw me off. I'll keep thinking about the scene from nothing to lose. <laughs> That's thinking. that's what you're. That's what we all think about. Yeah. When we're I mean, that's yeah. That's pretty cliche. That's what. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> there's, cla there's classic stuff over here. So you call it, You can put me in the classic corner. Oh. So I gotta go. I gotta give it sort of a back and forth. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me keep a they hand on it. it. Me. <laughs> I was gonna go with uh, that song, Pete. That's not a bad one. Who sang it? Uh, ooh. Oh. Real close. Oh, I Soul don't even know. Too uh, short. That's a good guess. I don't know. Uh, it was uh, they were called Next. Yeah. Next. With like a yes. couple X's in there. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. They were around at the same time as Five Eye. If you remember Five Eye, <laughs> I do not. Oh no, Five Eye was, was like was the number name? five, and then I V E was their name. Five Eye. Five Eye, and they had a some song about uh, baby when the lights. Go oh, yeah, I know that. Yeah, I know Every that. single word is clear. Baby, when the lights go down. Anyway, that was when they were like, all right, shut down, boy bands. This has gone too far. Yeah, there's always that guy. We gotta shut these guys down. It's too much. Once you get to five eye, we're done. Yeah. Uh, I was gonna say Soul Asylum Runaway Train. Ooh. Oh yeah. yeah. That'd be real oh, sad. Yeah. For people that especially of our of our age that remember the video. The video, exactly. Yeah. Oh missing kids really. Like, <laughs> yeah. Get me going. That would <laughs> <laughs> You're like, oh, missing kids, let's make more. <laughs> let's we'll make replace these more. kids. I gotta tell you, a, a playlist of those three songs back to back would be pretty fucking rude oh, in anybody's yeah. rhythm. Oh, yeah. I'm not gonna lie, I probably have listened to playlists that have had those three things back to back. <laughs> I went up first, the mash. <laughs> oh, why do, why do they call you DJ Monster Mash? <laughs> <laughs> Buckle up. Yeah. <laughs> Are you ready for every third song being the mash or at least parts of that song? Yeah, Scatman's in there more than you'd expect as well. You'd be, it was the graveyard smoke. You'd be surprised. Cutting those cutting together. Cutting together. Oh, he's killing it on the table. You'd be surprised how many times between songs I can tell you guys that I've been working in a lab. <laughs> <laughs> I was working in the lab. Oh, he makes that with Dr. Dre? Is that a cool idea? I've been working in the lab. I've been in the lab for years. Something like that. Yeah, that's bad. That's cool. That is not bad. That's free, DJs. There you go, DJs. I'm just making your lives easier every goddamn week. I don't know why I keep doing this for this freaking DJs. He goes town to town saving DJs. Chris, you know about my problem where I can't stop helping DJs, yeah. right? They call you <laughs> okay, Johnny DJs. It's time for me to come clean. I've been raising money for DJs, and you guys know I love all DJs of all kinds. And I've started like a sort of a sort of a UNICEF box that I've put around at sort of local <laughs> businesses, and it says I love DJs. We all love DJs. Let's give them a couple bucks. And I set them up. And I'm going to start it's going a back. Solid pitch. I'm going <laughs> back out next week and collecting them. I'd love for you guys to come with me. We're going to do yeah. some sort of promos for them where I 
I bring a DJ or two with me, and they I make them look sad on camera. It's gonna be really cool for Instagram. Easy thing to do. Yeah, yeah you can't. just put them on camera. Yeah, yeah. Otter's <laughs> got. I'm just telling Otter about it now. I need you to be my photographer. I'd love for you to be doing that. You, I, I he's, you. he's already signed on. It. Everybody right. needs to visit your website, drdj.gg. Yeah, I pretty much set that up. Tanking. It's not too good. It's not too yeah. good. Related, so I got another. I got an animal hypothetical for you. Uh, love it, because uh, love it. we're all familiar with love it. it. Love it's white, 2024. 2024. Me and Lovitz are. I'm trying to get Lovitz to fight me. Oh uh, yeah, yeah. We're it's trying a, to get Lovitz in here to fight Creasy. It's a little nice. event called Lovitz or Leave It's. The uh, <laughs> the loser has to leave its Sheet Harbor forever. Fight Sheet Harbor. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> both, <laughs> both parties are going to be pretty glad to get out of Sheet Harbor. I kind of want to lose, yeah. to be quite honest with you. Yeah. Uh, hey, everybody loses. <laughs> <laughs> we're all familiar with a werewolf. Yeah, you turn into a wolf, which is very inconvenient because mm-hmm. you're a wolf. What would be like an actual decent animal to like just turn into annoyingly in the middle of the night? Once a fucking, I guess it's every full moon, so once every what? twenty eight days or whatever. I mean, what would be the not? Who's going first? DJ would have to I believe that the moon is real. <laughs> <laughs> you're right about that. <laughs> that mean I can't be a uh, skeptical animal as well. It's true. What it's kind of a, lycanthropy would you like? I guess for like, I mean, for nighttime and you get to ch- to turn into something once every how many times? It's like once a month kind of thing. It's like your period, basically. You're a wolf. <laughs> <Jeez>. Wolf. Yeah. <laughs> you have a wolf yeah. period. To, to be to be clear, am I on my period if I turn into an animal? <laughs> You're not in your period. I was just making this once a month. No, 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 hey, there's nothing wrong with that. I just want to know what I'm getting into. No, you don't get to carry. I don't want to just show up because I'm already going to be shocked being aware or whatever, but I don't want to be like, oh, my God, I'm aware. And I'm like, oh, that's happening, too. All right, that's new for me because I'm just, just saying I didn't know I'd change sexes as well. And this is cool. I just would have brought more pants. One at a time would have been great. Can I just deal with one and then deal with the other one later? So I'm on the moon cycle. I mean, yeah. that's cool too. But again, the the double pants sitch would have been key <laughs> info before I, do like I got. You're in. not going pad. You're going double pants. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> keep, keep the period to the side for now. You can keep one pair. Am I gonna be a wear animal walking around the big old pads? So when I show up to scare people, I'm be like, well, the- they're gonna be like, oh, I kind of see your pads. So I know the message you're trying to get together, but you're, I can see your pads sticking out of your car. You're only pants. a woman once a month. You don't got time to learn tampons and stuff, man. You're just gonna put a yeah. pad down there. You're becoming also an animal, so it's not like you got like a, it's the vagina's gonna change shape. You can't really be pad, a tampon. As up. a wear no. animal, do I have to eat things? Like, do I have to eat humans and stuff too? You don't have to, but if you're an animal that eats humans and you turn into that animal around humans, you're probably gonna eat the humans. Yeah. Got you. Yeah. So you might not want to be a goddamn tiger or something. Can I take a pass and pass it around? <laughs> I mean, sure, we can go somebody else first. I, I don't even know. I don't even know what the best thing would be. I mean, I think a house cat is the best thing to be. I mean, I was going to say that. Yeah, I was. I, yeah. Yes. Yeah. I was going to say answer. that too. <laughs> but I don't want to. I sleep next to my wife. I don't want to turn into a fucking polar bear and then maul her in the middle of the night. That so. is true. But That's here's it. the other thing. But I think like, if you're a wear version of anything, you're going to do some mauling. Not if I'm a little a cat. Yeah, no, but that's, oh, that's cool. But vicious, that's yeah, but then cat. I'm gonna see something move Wait, and you shiny. Get, and then... you get smaller. Yeah. Okay, you get like cat size. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You become the animal. So you know, you're not your size transforming into a house cat. I my understanding of the whole transforming process is you become the shape of a wolf. Yeah, but you like grow inside. If you've ever seen like any monster movie, they don't turn into a smaller dog. They're like a grown man that turns into a yeah, monster. Yeah, they're a wolf man. Get, yeah, yeah, but yeah, wolves are huge. What wolves a are like is. you. You you would but be don't like they become actual wolves. I think it depends on what's no, lower. They're, they're, they're wolf men. They're yeah. half wolf, half man. I thought yeah. they yeah. just became a wolf. Well, they're no, like well, man no. shaped with a wolf face. Is basically yeah. what they all like. Thro- lycanthropy is like you have. Don't it's throw those words at me. I'm sorry, but it's lycanthropy. It's a human. It's the humans with the characteristics of the animal they turn. Fuck you. That Dungeons and Dragons, bitch. Uh, <laughs> same thing. Okay, well, I'm gonna go. What about like one of them docile animals, like a panda or something? You could turn Ooh. into like a were panda. Were panda would be. Uh, You'd be adorable so, for like oh, yeah. one one night of the year. That's one sick. night of the year, too. You want to spend that outside, is what I was thinking. That's why not house cat. That's fair. So I was thinking like first. if you, and if you don't want to go through being like if you get one night too like, you can make it through a night without eating. Like uh, you could be like a a were a were mountain lion. Okay. And you could just cruise around for a bit. What do you think? You could be a wear sloth and not even wear eagle. Well, I go wear eagle, wear bald eagle. I fly around for the night. Here's my problem with wear bald eagle. All right, and to get into semantics with you, you mm-hmm. turn into an eagle middle of the night. Because the thing is, you. My understanding. Let me go back into lycanthropy. Yes, do it. 
uh, once we're done our course in vampirology, <laughs> we can go to lycanthropy. Absolutely, great uh, word. super cool word. <laughs> Let's put them up on the board. Do you not? Do you become like animal brained as well? You don't have yeah. control of yourself, right? No, you don't. So you turn into an eagle at like seven thirty p.m. when the sun, the moon comes up. You go flying around the world, but like then the sun comes up and you're just somewhere stupid. You turn into a man on the side of a cliff Wait, somewhere. Also, he... in this scenario, do we still have the big dicks? Or... <laughs> <laughs> I do, but you don't anymore. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> just, I just want to be, so we, you become an eagle, that or? you're an eagle, it's very hard to fly because you've got a giant just donger, a rare blue yeah. whale, it's just, like, yeah, didn't just <laughs> hanging down on that fly. is that an eagle, I want to say yeah, but Jesus, is that Ron Jeremy wanna, uh, eagle flew by, <laughs> you guys saw the cock on that bald eagle, just like, <laughs> they should put that on the coin, <laughs> I mean, it was huge. It was like that eagle made some sort of a deal to go 15 years back. There's no way that eagle's got a dick that big naturally. That's a genie. Yeah, if you look sure. at that eagle's face, you can tell that he could have been rich. Boys, he uh, regrets it a bit. Turns out he couldn't do much with that dick. He would have rather $10 million. Boys, you check out the cock in that eagle? It must be a full moon. <laughs> I could swear that was eagle body male cock. I could swear that, that was male cock. Definitely, there is some shit going on in that eagle. <laughs> that ain't natural. That's all I'm saying. That ain't natural. The eagle or the dick. That That's neither one of them is natural. Hilarious. Jesus Christ. It doesn't negate my point that you're gonna wake up on the. 80 miles away from home and then get a walk home. You can, you can plan for it, though, right? Because even though you're an eagle, can you still... Yeah, and, that's like, and then your clothes are all fucked because you yeah. transform through them. Yeah, but like, can, you still, you can still think it's... From the woods. <laughs> Do you just stop thinking about everything when you're an eagle? You yeah, you're an eagle. Your yeah. brain's an eagle. But you're not the same person. Then nah, you like you wake, that's up, why the next, the you wake up the next morning, you're in the top of like a fucking radio tower. Yeah, that's, <laughs> and you're oh, naked. Or you're on the, or you're on the side, a giant of, a, you're yeah. on the side <laughs> of a fucking bus. Oh, yeah. You just fucking got yourself lambasted on the yeah, side of a yeah. city bus like a regular old pigeon. <laughs> People are just fucking Where being pigeon? like, oh, my God, I've never seen an eagle oh. splayed out on the fucking street like this. A were pigeon would be the worst thing yeah. to turn into. This were pigeon has a big old dead only. dick. <laughs> I ain't touching that thing. Not with that dick. Look at the dick on that fucking <laughs> pigeon. I can't believe I'm saying this, but goddamn, jealous of that pigeon. How <laughs> uh, do you got an animal to throw out here? I'd probably go bat. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Just do a thermos. You just eat bugs. Fly around. Okay. That's uh, just too good an answer. I don't even know. Uh, here's the thing. Sorry. Here's the thing. I think if you go any animal that lives in the wild, the chance of you ending up somewhere else is pretty likely, right? Unless you're a sloth. Where sloth? Yeah. But, yeah. Yeah. Where you're you wouldn't be able to get that far. Where sloth in Halifax? You're in you're like a pet <laughs> store. You probably don't even have to go outside. You just stay inside. You're gonna poop a bunch, but you're in the room. You don't yeah, do much. Sit there and eat it. Yeah, yeah. yeah, pretty much what's going on now. <laughs> Your wife leaves you. She's like, I can't watch you turn into a sloth. Anymore. It's not much different than right, right now. <laughs> on the subject of meat apples, I want to take a little survey. I'm, uh, I'm, I don't drink a lot anymore. You still, you still like a drink, do you? What's that? You're still a fan of a drink, are you? Back in the day, yeah, well, I had day, a few Chardonnays. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I get for asking. <laughs> yeah, uh, yeah, don't throw at what? me with a good time, Pete. <laughs> <laughs> it's the old fucking crotchless hand thing. It's my new move. The crotchless hand. There's no crotch involved, but there's a hand thing. Uh, what's the best drunk food? What's the best you're hammered is the end of the night? You say, fuck it. I'm going to eat it. I mean, I feel like you got to put parameters on that, too. It's like how drunk. Very. What's available. Yeah. Uh, you know what I mean? In my home, or if I gotta if I gotta travel, I'm yeah. gonna. I'm are we gonna... talking? Here's the thing: Are we talking like reality situation, yeah. or are we talking like ideal. if you get to have anything you yeah, want? Ideal, drunk food? ideal drunk no, food, or like? For sure. ideal? I mean, because if I'm just hammered, I'll eat yeah. half a brick of cheese, no problem. This is. I know. I know you will eat anything. <laughs> That's <laughs> who the hell are you? I gotta tell you. I'm just saying. It really sounds with like crackers you got... or anything, or just on its own. It, you think I got crackers? What, uh, I'm a billionaire that's got crackers hanging around? It sounds like he's trying to get us to justify him eating a block of <laughs> who, cheese. Who right do you think now. I am yeah, over here? I don't got any cheese for you. <laughs> okay. So, so now, sorry, all right. can I ask one question about the cheese? I mean, we haven't answered any of the first eight, but yeah, go another one. There's not, wait, what about cheese? We don't even ask about cheese. Well, I just want to know, if you're eating a block of cheese, are you cutting off like decent thin no, slices? No, snap it in half like I've never seen a block of cheese before. This is the skinny guy. <laughs> this is the guy that doesn't eat. I know, it's upsetting. And he's just eating, like, 
like barbarian style greasy. Yeah. yeah. But here's the problem. I think he would do that once, whereas we would eat pocket burgers like three times a week. Yeah. I'm doing it tonight. I'm a hundred percent doing that. That math yeah. checks out actually. <laughs> that yeah. math checks out. I think so. he eats a block of cheese and wakes I've up. I've never like, pulled oh, a cheeseburger out of my again. pocket. So this guy also right. wakes up and goes and uses his body for a while. Oh yeah. That's and you have you have to five days right. a week, right? So like that's like. That's a thing that always happens with you, which definitely keeps you in shape, which is like, and I'm not hating on it. It's a good thing for you. Me, <laughs> I will on. loaf. I'm a king loafer. Yeah, you'll loaf. I've seen the loaf. Oh, you put my face on a little piece of meatloaf. You can't tell the difference oh, yeah. between that and this right here. <laughs> yeah, oh, shit. Which one's yeah, meat? Which one's not you meat? Went, you went uh, savory. I had you more as like a sweet loaf, like a banana bread or something. Oh, like that. Ooh, yeah. God. Brad, Maybe banana bread, Thompson. Sarah Lee cake you know what? loaf. Let's, let's put them both on the Deep board. Deep and delicious let's put, let's put them both on the board. I just... <laughs> I just <laughs> finished a marble deep and deep. Uh, you can't beat a marble deep and deep. Buddy, I forgot how good they were. The oh, delicious. yeah, man. So you didn't forget, though. Before we move on, I though, actually didn't did. forget. I, will, I think I ate myself sick last time. <laughs> yeah. I will get behind any Nick for Thompson. Cake shake. But I don't know if deep and delicious Thompson is one we can really, I can sign <laughs> off on. Yeah. yeah. Let's no. No, let's cut that. This yeah. man's either deep yeah. or delicious, but he's not both. Just no. remix it. You're right. Deep and delicious. Deep and delicious. Delicious. We ain't even gotten to the bottom of this delicious name. Oh, yeah. We only skin level on T-Shane. Well, I have been known to just eat the frosting. Scatman calls in. He's like, I'll do the song. <laughs> Wait, it's about a guy who only eats the toppings of pizza? Oh, people okay. must hate this guy. I'll do it. <laughs> deep and delicious. 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 But did you ever get a pizza and it was just way too deep? You had to eat it anyway, so that's what I did. It's a very uplifting song. People don't know. Ba, ba, yeah. ba, ba. I did not Most know Most people that. would be taking their cake and start tossing. <laughs> That's because this guy always eats the motherfucking frosting. Okay. Ba, da, 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 da. okay. I was go. wondering what Tossin was doing. I'm the cake this. man. Oh. <laughs> I would do it deep. Delicious. I can't even remember what question we were talking about. God, drunk yeah. food, best drunk food. I mean, deep and delicious is in there. Deep and delicious, deep and delicious yeah. is better high food than it is drunk food. It is, yeah, yeah. So, but that's because uh, you're. I mean, you got to give it to the donor. I think you need, oh, see. I'm gonna or garlic fingers. Garlic fingers is a solid I mean, one. For can sure. I put this yeah. as a caveat? Please. What do you got going on the next day? Pooping. Yeah. A lot no, of but it. like if a I'm waking up and working the next day, I'm like, no, no, you're not working. This is a full on. You've been out like. Special old man hammered. So I get the next day off. Yeah, yeah. You got to you got the garlic fingers, day. extra cheese, bacon. That's on the list right there. Boom. I like it. See, I, I, might I, add, I might add to it. I might subtract from it, but that's going to be my cornerstone right there. Okay. I don't think you're going to subtract. You might add. But I feel like you're not taking anything. It's away. never going to go lower than that. So you're right. I'm not going to subtract from it. <laughs> Suzanne doesn't like bacon, so I got to get my garlic fingers without bacon. Same with Jenny. And She's a vegetarian, but in a dream world, I have bacon. A hundred percent. Yeah. In that world, a post-apocalyptic world where I got to share a bathroom with you and you're yelling at yourself in the mirror, we get garlic fingers afterwards. You want bacon? <laughs> <laughs> yes, I want bacon. The world ended. Touche, yeah. you want bacon on the garlic fingers? And I'm like, you fucking piece of shit. You yeah. fucking loser. What? Anything that just drives Otter, what's your face. poison? I don't drink. Right. So late night food, you're high. Let's put You've you in You've been a bag of shit at night, though. You're hanging, yeah. out, you're hanging out with us. We've had a couple of the uh, devil's piss. <laughs> Jesus. I'd go pee. I'd Do we got a call? What the hell is that? What yeah, was that? Why did you say that? You came at so hard. I know. I just, we've had a couple of the old Saucemans saloonsmans. Jesus uh, Christ. Can we get him something? Yeah. <laughs> Help him out here, Mikey. Mikey, give me something. We've had a couple. What's that? Just something to name a drink. Uh, I, I don't know. <laughs> We've had. A That's why we brought Mikey in for situations like this because he <laughs> always take a shot he can pinch hit a home run any We've time. Had, I, no, so I, I, I kind of I, I zoned out a little bit. It's okay. He, it's okay. Let's a, all get in the mode here. I'm gonna set you guys up. I want a name for a drink here. I'm I'm trying to ask Otter to what would he drink? Otter, the guys have been sitting around. We've been <laughs> watching the game. All of us have been sitting around clinking glasses and stuff. Okay, and we've so all had ourselves a glass of the donkey's drollops. The donkey's, donkey's drollops. What? I don't know about that. <laughs> drollops? You just make a last word up? Yeah. yeah. The drollops. Yeah. Buddy, I'll be, I'm not going to lie. I know it was a made up word, but I sometimes feel like I've had the case of the drollops. Buddy, I'm going to wake up tomorrow with the drollops. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. If yeah. I get that bag of burgers. It's oh, drollop city. Oh, <laughs> oh, it yeah. is drollops and a half. Oh, yeah. Look at this dirty drollop. Get her out of here. Yeah.
but a boneless wing. I, it's like a nugget. It's a nugget. It's, <laughs> yeah. it's, it's a nugget. nugget. It's a grown I mean, up nugget. Are, are they shaped nuggets? like dinosaurs? Because that's a difference maker for me. <laughs> <laughs> They've got huge dicks. <laughs> oh. okay. Wow, that's a done deal. Sweet Thai chili is the, the sauce you're looking for. That's the sauce. That's a good sauce. That's I the best say, sauce. Going. I couldn't order those because I couldn't say that word. Sweet Thai chili? Yeah, I would say. Uh, yeah. Which word couldn't you say? I like. I do like the. Um, I chai tilly is how I have to say that. Chai, chai tilly. Fuck you. Yeah. No, don't no, be mad. Uh, <laughs> don't you dare be mad at us because this fucking asking. ridiculous thing that yeah. popped up out of nowhere. <laughs> this is not on us at all. That you can't say sweet Thai chili. We have nothing to do with that. You fucking freak. Don't you dare try to make me feel bad for making fun of you for not being able to say sweet Thai chili. What did I tell you about bringing out the devil in my boy? Jesus yeah. Christ. It's not even laying fine. guilt on me. It. I have guilt for everything. I don't have guilt for you not being able to say three very simple words. Which specific word can't you say? Sweet Thai chili. Look how easy that was. Get close to that microphone so I can make fun of you and they can hear you. I understand. Under pressure when a server is there, I can't say it every time it comes out as chai tilly. But oh. they, they'll know what you mean if you say that. But they look at me like I'm an idiot. Because you are. Yeah. yeah. What because you, you can't say can't sweet touch. But if you garlic. see it on the menu, if you see it on the menu, right? Yeah. And the server... No, I can't be like, oh, I'll have this guy. That's no, no, worse. No, 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 no. I'm, I'm, I'm going to give you an option on that, too. You see it on the menu. The, the server's not there yet, right? <laughs> Maybe they're going to be there in seven minutes or five minutes or something. Now, you look at the words that are in front of you, and you say, and you're in your head, you're like, sweet Thai, chi thai chili. Even if you get sweet. two of those three words, you'd be fine. You could even say, I'll sweet take the, chili. the Thai chili wings. I'll, I'll say, say the, chai, the Thai wings. You almost say. The thai I would, chili I would did not even kind did. of say you could chai what I'm chili. Saying is, I've you, never said chai chili in my life. <laughs> I'll say I'll the, chai, the Thai wings. What I could say is that you could just take a second and figure it out. You could. Yeah, you could take a minute. I guess I'm getting so wound up. It's just you and the wing. <laughs> Relax. Everything's fine. He's being much nicer about this than I am. I'm very mad that you can't say. This it. Like you got amped up. I'm just trying to. I'm just trying to put a little water on the fire that you just lit up there, Chris. I mean, you got amped up at my boy. <laughs> I was originally kind of doing it for the show, but then I really got into it. I, really I know. Felt it. I, really I felt that, and I appreciate it. I feel. It I feel like we just broke through a wall. Yeah. Didn't I've never out. really gotten mad at you. That's didn't wait. Didn't, really didn't work out great for honor, but I, I like being in the middle of it. It'll work out great if you can get a sweet Thai chili wing. Oh, you almost. I almost did there. I almost tripped. It's in my head now. Almost tripped. Yeah. He got the curse. See that? I mean, you guys are coming in hot, but. It's like no, no, we're not coming head. in hot as sweet hot. fucking chai tilly over here. <laughs> yeah. Just relax there, chai tilly. Chai, 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 chai have... tilly, ladies. Oh, chai <laughs> tilly, sweet chai tilly. She's a chai tilly and she's so sweet. <laughs> Sorry, a sweet chai tilly sounds all right too. It sounds like a nice old lady. Oh, chai tilly sounds like a good like. Uh, have you met chai tilly down the road? Chai tilly tiramisu. Chai tilly tiramisu. Okay, that's a lot of words. Sort of a chai chai spin on tiramisu. I saw it on the internet today. It was actually looked delicious. I'm not a tiramisu guy. No? No. Let's just leave it there. <laughs> this isn't going anywhere. Good grease. I will say no to a, a tiramisu. You know, I can't argue with you there. I will not say no. Yeah. All right. I will. Uh, <laughs> food related hypothetical. Let's go into it. Uh, let's say, I don't know, you got arrested for murdering somebody. You got arrested for unalive and somebody kind of hate YouTube. <laughs> <laughs> I know. I know, dude. I know. You got arrested. I for... didn't even pick up on it when you said it. That's how much I hate it. And I'm the one who's like, man, we got to start saying unalive. You got arrested it for sucks. removing the life of a person. That rolled off the tongue, Tracy. <laughs> Keep it going, brother. <laughs> <laughs> you got arrested for grand larceny. Okay. And they're going to put you to death. They're going to put you to unalive. Yep. <laughs> Uh, I should have just, I didn't even need the setup for this. I could have just said, what's your favorite bread? But I put a whole goddamn thing around it. I built the whole story. And I forgot you can't say any of the words. Yeah. You're on death row. You're on unalive yeah. row. Yeah. yeah. Unalive. It's do, hard to be on unalive Do you have to row. say that now? Uh, just on YouTube, it helps your fucking algorithm or something. And I don't even know dance. if that's true. It's just what I see. these. We're just, we're sticking to the rules. We got to this point. We're sticking with it. Uh, we don't know. You're on unalive row. Okay. At some sure, point, the yeah. state is going to unalive you for crimes against you. Unalive men walking. <laughs> I love that in the green mile. Uh, you get your last meal, but they're like, we don't do like any last meals anymore. You gotta get a sandwich. Yeah. What is the? What is your like? You got one meal left, bread wise. What's your go to bread? What's the best banging bread for your goddamn last meal? Before you're unalive. Go ahead, Mikey. After your time on unalive row. I'm I'm pretty uh, plain Jane on this. I I would go straight up like homemade white bread. 
Okay. Homemade white bread's good though. Homemade white bread choice. is delicious. It's delicious. It's like candy. That's, it is like candy. you know, and that's not even that's. I would say I would venture to say that a good homemade white bread is is not plain Jane. That's something you don't get to have a lot in that the run, toasted unless you now. make an effort to go Come get on. it. It's not something you run across a lot. I will. Yeah. I, I will. I do diverge from you a little bit on the toasted because I'd prefer just out of the oven, still hot. Yeah. I, yeah. Ideally. Absolutely. Ideally. It's my last meal. With no, a big you, with you a big guys. Cock. <laughs> the bread have a big old dink on it or what? Do you guys remember like the Black and Decker bread makers that everybody had for a while? Yeah. And people could make them. Those made a good loaf of bread. Yeah. And they were great because they would make the outside really crispy and the inside oh, nice yeah. and moist push just a little too late, just a little too long, right? Am I right? <laughs> I fucking came right in I on the end I can't believe that was a band name for a while. That's yeah, incredible. absolutely. Moist. I uh, once found a CD after one of my sister's parties and it was a moist CD and it looked so cool because it was like moist and i was like oh my god these guys are way and i touched it and it was actually just a moist cd it was gross it was, <laughs> what am i touching here what am i touching right now i asked myself what am i touching what am i touching what am i fucking touching that anyway like a game show that's a nice what am I cho- that's a nice choice mikey it's white, choice. white that's a class I mean, that is classy you can't it's kind of boring it. But. you can't beat it it is uh, yeah it's not but exotic I, yeah, right. it's probably the most delicious oh 100 percent. what's yours what white i'd probably go with like a nice sourdough that's good. I'm, I'm on the sourdough train recently. I'm a, yeah. I'm a, I mean, if I listen to my heart, I'd probably say white, but I'd probably say sourdough just so the cops think I was interesting before they unalived me. Yeah, <laughs> absolutely. Oh. This guy's a little different than normal. You know? sure. well, or they'd be like, eh, he's trying too hard. Yeah, he's sourdough. Really at this point. They'd really probably care? be thrown off when it was just a turkey sandwich with no condiment, no mayo, no, yeah, they'd just be like, no lettuce. Yeah, so you just eat this with sourdough and just turkey. Yeah, That's yeah. disgusting. Put a little salt on it, maybe some butter. Otter, <laughs> bread, the, bread meat. What do you got? That's my turkey sandwich. Uh, I'd be. Like, I'd ask for a club on butter crust for sure. Butter crust. Butter, butter crust. crust. What's that? Butter crust is like. Uh, it's it's a, like a white a version white. of white bread. Yeah, with it's a different a, crust. Okay. Yeah, it has like a. Okay. Gl- it has like a glossy crust that like. That, that sounds that, delicious. When you, when you so might call it a butter crust. Butter crust <laughs> sounds. That delicious. just changed the game though. When you when you toast my it, the outside gets super crispy and the inside super soft. I like that. Start calling you butter, Chris. Uh, we have a bre- we have a bread at the uh, restaurant, and it's called Belge Kilo, and it's just a white bread. But it is there's something about it that I like, and what I, I think like. My grandmother died of that. Belge Kilo, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. What, what is that. it called? Belge Kilo. When you got when you got like that back when you got that back tennis in the, player from the Czech Republic. Yeah, yeah. When he, rank when, number thirty six. If, if you world. got if you got Belge Kilo in the winter back in the twenties, they'd wrap you up in the blankets and put it in the <laughs> cellar. Yeah. yeah, yeah. She's got the kilo. Yeah, half her face gets paralyzed. Absolutely no, but it's this white bread that if you put it on a, like a flat top and uh, grilled cheese style it, it is. It's buttery. It's, it's buttery. great. We're all in the moment. We're all in the zone. Now I'm. You know what? I, what am I putting in the middle of it? I don't know. Whatever the fuck I want, I can make it a Chetty Winslow. Which is jam. Oh, yeah. jam. We, we Just still, sit we back still. and enjoy. It. It's a piece of Belge Kilo. It used to be an English muffin. <laughs> Belge Kilo, uh, butter, strawberry jam, and cheddar cheese. And it is. I've had a Chetty Winslow. By the Chetty way. Winslows are on point and they please everybody. It sounds good, but there's no way my last meal sandwich doesn't have meat in it. Yeah. That's a good point. I'm putting a big hunk of something in there. Yeah, you're right. Maybe a steak sandwich. Yeah. You said that a lot. <laughs> Put I'm putting meat salt in there. In there. I'm, yeah. all I know. Does it have a big dink or what? <laughs> I can't. I can't sleep without it. I am number one, not number two. If I'm not the one, I'm uncomfortable. See the competition I've been running through. Leveled up, I only see him in my rear view. All right, I got one more Tigerson for yeah. soft landing. Tigerson for soft. Soft landing this because I think lofty. this is maybe the most important question of all time. The styling, guys. Let's. I need your focus. I need Dial you. It in. I've not acknowledged how ridiculous your hat is, and it's been very difficult. <laughs> over, the, over the headphones. <laughs> you look like Joe Pesci from With Honor. <laughs> I, I, right now. I feel like oh, you're yeah. really uh, abusing this not being on camera thing. You can't just it. look stupid I'm, and have yeah. us not say anything. I encourage it. I love it. Yeah, yeah. Let me live, dude. This is I think you should mind. outfit that whole corner like Joe Pesci's van that he lived in in With Honor. <laughs> Just really lean into it. You do that, I'm moving into the shit. <laughs> oh, that's great. It's uh, 400 a month. <laughs> it's actually not a bad deal. Yeah, There's no bathroom or kitchen. You can't use ours. <laughs> Dude, uh, you can use that little part that you're pissing off of as both a bathroom and a kitchen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. The snow bag up a little there. hot plate. <laughs> On the other side. You piss and cook your sausages. Yeah, yeah not at the same time, hopefully. Yeah. Just like yeah, Joe Pesci from With Honors. Yeah, you there when it's warm. <laughs> Like cooking bacon when you're naked, you're gonna get burned. Oh, yeah, naked bacon. Naked bacon. Naked bacon is a problem. 
came to that. Bakey, pretty, bakey. pretty cool. Anyway, All my sweaters have uh, just splotches on them because I keep cooking bacon and then being like, ah, fuck my sweaters. I know. That's brutal. Brutal. I believe it. I have an apron, but I just can't put it on. Crazy. Yeah, at this point, it. we're all sitting here in limbo in this plane, and I'm ready for you to take us in for that soft landing, you promise. All right. Is that a lost callback? Well, I just, we were just shaking up here. We're, so there's four of us. Here we are. We're four. all very different gentlemen. We are. Now, let's say, I don't know, they decided to make a Golden Girls reboot with all white men, <laughs> which is it's among the last thing on the it's list of things that's going to happen. Mm -hmm. Mark my words. <laughs> If they were to do that and we got cast, who would play who in the Golden Girls? I feel like out of the gate, Mikey's probably uh, Sophia. I'll take that. I will 100% take that. You're tiny. You're witty. Yeah, 100% take that. You say that. something really clever and then you disappear for a couple minutes while we fucking slog it out with the horse. Yeah. Like <laughs> don't tag that on I'm kidding. don't tag I'm that kidding. on i'm kidding fake italian i've been kidding but that is dead on mikey is sophia mikey sophia that's, yeah. a, that's mikey's, the easy a, mikey's a sophia and i'm not gonna lie up top kind of jealous yeah but i feel like that's you a good one i feel like you might uh, well i don't know this is who tough. do you think i am it's kind of tough to tell who you are like yourself i'll be honest with you i feel like i'm gonna just i'm trying to knock out the easy ones first i feel like well, you sophia well, well let me if i can interject please Let's hear it from. I'm just uh, gonna say what I think. I think Pete would be a real, real Dorothy. I was gonna say the exact same thing. I and I'm not happy For about you? it. For you? Yes. Yeah, yeah. I'm not pleased about You're it. You're 100 percent a Dorothy. But looking around the room, I feel oh, like out of all the P. people Arthur here, over here. Oh, yeah. I got. I unfortunately am the B. Arthur of the yeah, group. Yeah, you're 100 percent Dorothy, which yeah. is also not a bad one. I'm only saying it because I'm the most manly out of then all I of you. Then I think. <laughs> then I. I have to say that I think if I can take it from here, guys, I'll take this off Please. your hands here. If there's four of us here, this right? is tough. This is where I got. This is where I ran into a problem earlier. I I have to say, I believe that I would be the Blanche Devereaux. Yeah, that Island. was not even a problem. Yeah. That was not, I was like, yeah, if you say anything else about it. A Blanche <laughs> Devereaux, a lady that spends a little bit more than the average time on her back. Oh, I don't know why I said She's that. Been, uh, you might get jockey. laid less than her if you talk like that. So, <laughs> <laughs> She had a pretty good uh, success rate, but she was killing it. I think that's yeah. where we. I think we all came together for that. Pretty cool. Yeah. But that leaves pain. Otter as uh, Rose. Is that how you feeling about Rose that? Rose Nyland. No he one's doesn't... ever said anything as nice as comparing me to Betty White. So okay. Yeah. yeah. Like this is. I feel like that. You're kind of like you're very polite. You're very nice. You're the only one of us who's not cynical the entire time. Yep. I'll die it. Absolutely. And also because of your tits. And also. <laughs> <laughs>